Hey guys, uh, I've just started vlogging a bit late today uh, in the afternoon, it's uh, 3 p.m. and uh, yeah, basically today what have I done? I met up with some friends, went out for uh, lunch uh, in Birmingham. Um, he's flying away today so um, it was a good little catch up. They're my school friends that I've had since I was um, small anyway so it's always nice meeting up with them. Um, and yeah, right now I just thought I'd just um, do a little vlog today. Um, we're taking out the Phantom. Uh, this one and my baby here the uh, the murder that ghost uh, we're taking this for a wash this is the uh, 458 Italia here uh, sorry not the 458 Italia 458 spider yes the Italia is obviously the uh, the coupe version so yeah I think dad's taking that out now and uh, me and Sahail um, Sahail works with me he's also a friend and he helped me with some of my YouTube videos and he now works for pet um, but yeah we're taking this out for a wash um, because the valet didn't come in, well the guy that comes and washes the cars for us didn't come in today because it was raining so uh, I think he had a day off um, but we need these cars cleaning as they're going to be going out to customers so they need to be looking Spinks Bank brand new. So yeah, just going to head out now, get these washed and uh, you can come along for this evening. Let's go. Do a little attire check, I don't know if you can see it in the reflection of the ghost but we've got Renove's uh, black and white t-shirt on, little capsule thing, make sure you check them out, that's in the descriptions as well. Lube check, black, all black, everything. Black is actually one of my favorite colors, if, even if some of you class it as a color or not. Honestly, you cannot go wrong with black. Yep, there we are, this is the interior of it. Oh God, let me unlock it. There we are, curtains and the, oh, this is just, this is my baby. The Lord Mobile, gonna put the Lord number plate back on this uh, towards the end of the year, thought I'd just keep the pet on for a bit. But yeah, we're gonna head out now to the car wash and uh, we shall catch up very soon when we're at the car wash. Let's go. There we are now guys at the, uh, well, it's the nearest car wash that I trust out here. No, brother, no chemical on the on the car please, yeah? Yeah, so, uh, just clean it up. I know what you guys are probably thinking, yes, it's criminal to uh, get your cars clean from here, but desperate times call for desperate measures, and uh, yeah, they need to be done. So, um, yeah, there we are, this car's getting washed. Let's see how they come out. They sell, they're going out to customer today? Yeah, today. Yeah, so they've got an evening wedding today where the customers will be needing this car, these cars. So yeah, obviously, we'll have to do with uh, what we can and obviously, yeah, we'll, we'll get some new shampoo made, get some new sponges out and stuff. So I'm uh, watching them like a hawk, make sure it's done proper. I just told you, like, do not, that's it. I trust you. Yeah, as you can see, you've got the 22-inch Vossen CB1 wheels as well. The backs are concaved a little. Makes it look mean. Got the curtains on it. Satin black bonnet. This is the Phantom. Ah, got me with the water. It's a phantom, that's a ghost, in case you didn't know. Swell marks galore there. Oh, damn, I'm going to have to get a detailer in after this to sort it out. But yeah, I've just had a call from my dad and uh, Bully, uh, my uh, driver. He's coming to pick up the uh, Black Ghost as it's going on the job now. So yeah, he's got to shoot off, do an evening wedding there. Um, and uh, the White Phantom's also going on a job. And the Ferrari's also on a job as well. The Ferrari's also on a job as well. So uh, a busy, busy-ish Monday evening for pet. No, I wouldn't say it's busy. I think it's probably more calm. Uh, we've been uh, a bit more panicky than this before. Uh, I think everything's running smooth, alhamdulillah. 
Well, there she is, all nice and clean. I'm going to take it over into the next bay to get it dried off. Ah. All right, key in the centre console, push to start. Effortless. Ah. Some Asian tracks left over from previous customers, so yeah, put it into D. And uh, just drive it around. Dun, dun, dun. Make sure don't hit it anywhere. There we go. Reverse. Pull it towards you. Oh god. All the way up. And there it motivates it. It tells you there. It's now in reverse. Look at the cameras. The guy's getting a little impatient now. Wipers. And then back. So annoying. Okay, like that. There we go. Let me just put it into park. Push that. Unlock it for him. There we go. Oh, there we go. All unlocked. I'm gonna give it a nice clean from the inside. And uh, yeah, that should be it then. And Bully's gonna come and take this car away. So now this is just getting the, the vacuum and uh, drying it off. And uh, it's just finishing off the wash on the Phantom there. So Hale's taking that, and uh, Bully's taking that. And I don't know what I'm taking home. So Hale, do you know what I'm going home in? You're walking home, aren't you? I'm, I'm walking home. <laughs> Need to get these wheels refurb soon. As you can see, they've been scratched. Ah, painful. Don't want to be seeing them, so yeah. Plastic dip flying lady. Uh, gloss black wrapped grill. All done by Projects UK. I'll leave a link to those guys as well. Um, and yeah, some more. I think these wheels have not been curbed yet, so that's a plus sign. And then I've got the, the door handles as well. They've been wrapped in gloss black and the, the trim around here. So the only thing, the only thing that's been uh, plastic dipped is the uh, flying lady on the front. But I'm gonna be getting that painted very, very soon to get that gloss, uh, gloss black finish. Um, and that's the only thing that won't be reversible. Everything else can be reversed and go back to stock whenever it wants, which is, uh, you know, which is brilliant. I'd rather that than have it done permanently, um, which means that I can't, uh, I can't take the car back to factory um, if I wanted to sell it. So yeah, that's brilliant. Um, again, Projects UK did the conversion for me, so a big shout out to them. Um, and uh, they managed to get hold of the wheels, do the whole conversion, and uh, yeah, fantastic job on those guys. So yeah, thanks guys for that. Um, absolutely loving it. Wherever it goes, it's a massive head turner. So uh, yeah, big thank you to them. So Big Man Bully's just arrived now um, and uh, they, he's doing an airport run at Gatwick Airport uh, for some clients. So uh, the ghost is going to be heading all the way to London just to pick up uh, some uh, customers from the airport and take them to wherever they've got to be. There we go. Pet travels all over the UK, guys. Uh, for you, you know, caters for everything. Weddings, birthdays, and airport transfer, transfers, the lot. Um, and yeah, so I think I'm going to be going home in this whip now. <laughs> so yeah. Uh, from a ghost through an Avensis, but not a problem. At the end of the day, as long as it's got four wheels, it's going to get me home. I don't care. It's all good. Yeah. Um, then we went to London. Okay. Colin, that's my dad got you working real hard. Real hard. <laughs> really hard. <laughs> as you get, he's travelling all over the country. Four o'clock this morning. Just tell me, whilst I was in Pakistan, how many hours sleep did you get? Two. <laughs> There's Colin there. Colin's been working with my dad for nearly 25 years now. And uh, he's been on and off the scene. And uh, he's one of our loyal workers there. Top, top man, an absolute soldier, an absolute grafter. And he's uh, a great person to have on the team. 24-hour um, call out, just the man that we need. There we are, Bully's gone. Bully's got to be there for seven. And uh, right now it's. What? Oh, yeah, no, don't worry, I ain't got you. I ain't got you on cam. Bully's a little camera shy. <laughs> She's got the back of your head. Is that alright? <laughs> Go on, Bully, you're going to get late. Go. Off 
she goes to Gatwick. Safe journey, boss. Look at that cheeky face. Cheeky little face. Colin said that I'm not allowed to sit in his... He's written his car off. Oh, he's written his car off? Yeah. The Subaru, he's written his Subaru off. Okay. <laughs> so Colin said uh, um, I'm, to, I'm not prestige enough to be in his car. So, uh, yeah, he's, he's left me here. And uh, I'm stuck with Sahel and the Phantom. And uh, we're going to be heading over to Pet HQ after this. <laughs> Sahel, how did you write his car off? Uh, oh, a woman went into the side of him. Oh yeah, that, that's a classic one, isn't it? Uh, yeah, yeah. I didn't, you know, I didn't crash it because of my own fault. A woman went into either the back of me or the side of me. Always blame it on the women. Yes, plus points for me from the women. I'm pretty sure it's illegal to ride your bicycle on the pavement, Mr. Community Police Officer. So there we are. All washed up, clean. That mirror finish. Beautiful. <laughs> awesome. The interior is cleaned as well. We have a quick look. Just check it all over. Yep, piano wood is looking fantastic. Smells beautiful. We are ready. Oh, 50p. Ugh. Look after the pennies and the pounds will look after themselves. So, yep. Yeah, all clean. All ready to go for this evening. And uh, good luck to the, uh, the groom and the uh, bride. Hope they enjoy the wedding tonight. I might be at that wedding myself, to be honest, been invited, so yeah, might head over. But yeah, nice clean phantom there for you. We're gonna head over to Pet HQ now, let's go. Go left. I should really be in the back of hell. That seat's just calling me out. Why am I here, Sahil? You should drive me. <laughs> Sometimes we like playing the game, like we never ever ever get the chance of sitting in the back of this, very rarely. And whenever we get the chance, someone always jumps in the back, but then when there's only just two of us and one jumps in the back, there's always an argument. So, you know, you're driving, I'm sitting in the back, so I guess we both have to just sit in the front. Yeah, we're in the, the big bad Phantom. It's like a boat. Piano wood and a seashell interior. Uh, nice little contrast to the white outside. Right, let's go. The timepiece of all timepieces. Rolls Royce clock and with a touch of a butter. You ready? This isn't James Bond James Bond shit. Yeah, ready? Three, two, one. Boom. <laughs> I prefer the clock though, a little bit more elegant. And what else do we have? We have this button here. Switch it to manual. See the flying lady on the front? Now you see it. Now you don't. Let's bring her up again. There she is. Now you see it. Now you don't. <laughs> In case you couldn't see it just then, let's try it once more. There we go. It's not a Rolls Royce, unless the spirit of ecstasy is out. There we are. Should I turn it off? Yeah, turn it off. Right, we're at Pet. Let's give you a little update on the place. Let's go. You can get my shoes dirty, bruv. One second. All right, they've done a fair bit upstairs, so I'm just gonna go upstairs and quickly show you what they've done today. Okay, so the, uh, we've got the plasters in today. You can see he's finished off this wall today. It's down here. Done a nice job here. So yeah, it's all looking, starting to look real, real now. That wall's been done. And he's just doing the office, well, he's doing the prayer room at the moment. So yeah, letting them get on with it. It's happening, slowly but surely. So yeah, we're gonna go downstairs now into the port cabin. And, uh, well, I sound like Bear Grylls there. <laughs> we're gonna go down into the porter cabin and see what's there. Welcome to Pet. <laughs> this is where we're running the operation from now. Office number two, so yeah, does the job. That's my dad's desk, that's the house, and mine is everywhere. I'm out and about, but yeah, that's it. That's the future office, inshallah. Looking good, love the red on it. Fantastic, okay. 
such a messy office. Look at that, all oh, that shredded paper. No one's ever bothered to vacuum. Look, look at these, look at these chairs, ready? Oh, did you see that dust come out of it? Oh, look, you can even see my handprint on it. Vile, disgusting. Up there. There we are, this is my little, uh, little piece of graffiti here. It takes six months to build a Rolls Royce and 13 hours to build a Toyota. Now, why did I write that on the wall? Well, basically, um, every person that comes into this office and says, how long is it going to take? How long is it going to take to build this building? And basically, to sum it up, that, uh, you know, quality things will take time. Um, not saying that Toyota is a bad brand, not, not, not at all, but uh, when you've got to Put, you know, pay attention. You've got to pay attention uh, to detail. It takes time, and yeah, you know, it's not about just grabbing onto whatever you see first. You've got to source the materials. You've got to source the top end stuff. You've got to make it. You know, it's got to have that wow factor to uh, to put it short. But yeah, that's it really. So yeah, it's going to take its time, but inshallah, it will be built on time. The wallpaper, like it. Aventadors. This is really. I'm going to miss this office. This border, Gavin. It's been good. Like, we communicate through the doors, so and you just like, Sahel, Sahel, Sahel. <laughs> and you get to sit at Messi's and they pass it out. The internet used to be absolutely ridiculously slow and pathetic, but now what we're putting out, we've got, we big got thanks to BT, what we BT got? BT Infinity. BT Infinity, and BT Infinity, we've got uh, an average of 16 to 17 MB. Uh, upload speed that means that I can get a an 800 MB YouTube video up to you guys in about just a minute or so I don't believe that I've got to put it to the test yet but uh, yeah where I live I can't get good internet speed so that's quite bad but yeah we're just uh, I don't know what I'm gonna do after this so um, we'll just wait and see Papa Pet has arrived Michelin man give us a wave yeah one's here but you gotta give us a wave <laughs> What a cutie. And ladies and gentlemen, I present to you the Michelin Man. There he is. <laughs> we can't continue now. We must stop. Do you know why? Because him goes to me, Bernie went mad on me. <laughs> and him the boss. Don't change your clothes and I tell him, say, don't change your clothes and put No, he wet himself, that's why he changed. <laughs> so earlier, I think this guy didn't know who I was because I'd been away on holiday and these pastors had just come in. So I've come in and I've asked him, uh, um, I asked him a few questions about his plastering job and he went absolutely crazy on me but uh, I think it's just all light, light banter but yeah, <laughs> it was funny, it was funny at the time Obviously he's done a great job As you can see, I'll show you Plastering is a very skilled job Hats off to him Look, smooth as a baby's bum All nice and level, perfect Top, top plasterer this guy Obviously Michelin man <laughs> You know that's a joke by the way his name is my dad. <laughs> but yeah, yeah, it's just um, going every evening we go over with the builders and what they've done um, and just, yeah, we just keep on top of uh, everything. It's nice to know what's actually happening uh, instead of just sitting back and, you know, not getting involved, you know. So obviously there's a lot of heart and a lot of uh, love going into building this. So, uh, and hopefully it will show once it's completed, inshallah. Bernie, you want money? Give me more water. Too bad. Ask him how many kids he's got. Bernie, how many kids you got? How many, many ki kids and nine mum? Twenty kids and nine mum? Twelve kids and nine different ladies. Oh my god, twelve kids, nine kids different ladies. Four, four. Bernie, you player! Yeah. I don't keep them here, I keep them back home. Aye. Three here, one in like that. Bless, bless. The more the merrier. You see, you have to know to How many boys? How many boys? How many girls? You have to know to live your life uh, because 
if you have no um, one woman, you don't have to beat. Maybe that one can make some money, that one makes some money, but if all of them in one place, what are we going to do? How many, how many boys, how many girls? Six and five. Wow. <laughs> Let me see that one. Smashed it. Oh, who's this geezer, boss? I'm afraid, I'm afraid. Come look for me. I'm afraid, I'm afraid. I'm afraid. Oi! Come here. I'm afraid. 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 i am afraid 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 i am